What's going on guys? Today we're talking about how much cardio you should do if you're trying to lose weight. Is cardio any good for weight loss? Well, let's find out. If you're wondering is cardio is the ultimate fat burning exercise or not, well, we've got the answer for you. Maybe you've already tried losing weight with cardio and you didn't have any success. Well, if you're not alone in this case, cardio requires a lot of energy. It leaves you exhausted, stressed out, fatigued and sore. It's not really a great activity to feel amazing. And there's only so many hours that you can exercise in one day. And if you don't see any results, increasing how much and how long you exercise is not really the solution. And on top of that, numerous studies have already proven that cardiovascular activity is not the answer to weight loss. You might see some progress at first, but when your body adapts to the exercise, then you will no longer see progress. Because low effort and steady, steady state exercises deplete your decogen stores and not so much the fat stores. So let's have a look why you should avoid cardio for weight loss. Well, this exercise is catabolic. It means it breaks down muscles. You can build some muscles at first to perform the workout in the beginning, but you will lose little energy afterwards when your body adapts to the exercise. You will spend less and less calories after each session. And if you feel exhausted and angry after cardiovascular exercises, then you are not really enjoying the process. And the key to lose weight is picking an activity that you enjoy on a regular basis. Cardio exercise will increase your stamina and your endurance, but it will do nothing for your strength and flexibility. And both of these are very important if you want to build a lean and toned physique. So you should stop overdoing cardio because this will lead to imbalances, soreness, stiffness and injuries. It will hurt your joints in the long run cause cravings and leave you completely exhausted. It's not the optimal way to go if you want to improve your performance and your health. So burning as much calories as you can is not the best way to lose weight. Instead, you should focus on increasing your strength and flexibility because your body will need a lot of energy to repair and regenerate your muscle fiber. It will continue burning calories even when you're not exercising. An effective way to lose weight is having denser muscles with more fiber that will increase your metabolism. And your body will increase the rate at which it burns calories. And this results in faster weight loss. There's many solutions for energy that your body can use, like blood sugar or glucose, glycogen stores, fat stores, and muscle tissue. And what you should do is preventing your body to catabolize muscle tissue for energy. And the best way to do this is increasing your muscle mass. So why should you pick yoga for weight loss? Well, yoga has many benefits. It will help you sleep better, improve your mood, improve your energy levels. If you practice it often, it also has therapeutic properties. It will reduce the risk of diabetes, heart disease and cancer. Yoga is a very ancient and proven practice. It has been around for thousands of years and has already helped millions of people around the world. It has become very, very popular in the last centuries and for good reason. Yoga is not just physical exercise. It combines physical poses, but also breathing exercises and meditation. And it will improve your physical, your mental, emotional and spiritual health. 
you got is the healthiest and safest way to lose weight there are many types of yoga if you're wondering it's not just only stretching there are gentle yoga types but also very vigorous and high intensity yoga styles vinyasa ashtanga bikram yenga hatha yoga are all different types of yoga that you can find there is are very popular and Practicing a very intense yoga session can burn up to 750 calories per hour, which is quite a lot and enough to lose weight effectively. Yoga, when practiced correctly and regularly, will provide many benefits for your health and your well-being. It is a great way to build strong and long muscles. It will increase your strength, your flexibility, and your endurance at the same time. It improves your metabolism, the rate at which your body burns calories, but also strengthens your joints, your nerves, and your connective tissues. Yoga is also a great way to prevent injuries, joint problems, and is a powerful rehabilitation tool after an injury, for example. Many people love yoga because of the way it makes them feel. It reduces chronic pain that you may have, back pain or arthritis, joint pain. Yoga is rejuvenating, revitalizing and leaves you filled with positive energy. After each yoga class, you should feel better than when you arrived. Yoga is a way of life. It has a deep philosophy behind it with a set of principles. The yoga community is also very loving, caring and accepting. Yoga teaches compassion, acceptance and there's no competition in yoga. Yoga focuses on how you feel, on improving your self-awareness and mindfulness. It will make you appreciate your life and your body even more. Yoga can also be practiced anywhere with almost no equipment. Just put on some comfortable clothes and you can, you can start today right at home with online classes. So what's the best way to lose weight? It is not cardio for sure. Cardio will leave you exhausted and hungry, provide little results over the long run. It depletes your blood sugar, but has very little effect on fat in the long term. What you want to do is build long and strong muscles, increasing your strength and flexibility. And yoga is a great way to do this. To be more active, you should primarily focus on choosing an activity that you enjoy. The best exercise is the one that you do regularly. There are many types of yoga out there for all ages, all levels. You can pick a beginner friendly type of yoga and progress from there. I highly recommend that you try it out and give yoga a good go. It will help you lose weight very effectively. It will make you feel amazing. And it will bring you inner peace, balance and harmony. Yoga will not only improve your physique, but also influence positively every other areas of your life. So thank you so much for watching today, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and I will see you tomorrow.